Welcome to Renaissance Art in Venice and the artist Giovanni Bellini. He was born in Venice in 1413, with father and brother Gentili also great artists. His father and later Giovanni had workshops producing commissioned pictures, but also training apprentices, of whom Titian was one. The picture Madonna and Child is my favourite of all Renaissance paintings. It is a triptych in the sacristy of the church of Santa Maria Gloriosa, known as the Frari, meaning it was built by Franciscan friars, the second one to be built on this site. St Francis, born into a wealthy family of textile merchants in Assisi, gave up his wealth to bring the poor to Christ. They lived around the factories in dirt and squalor and would never dream of entering the rich basilicas and beautiful churches in their dirty rags. So the Franciscans started building simple churches fast. They chose the cheapest materials, bricks and wood, building where the workers lived in the outskirts of cities and towns. Churches were built in under a year and then artists like Giotto in Assisi took about two months to paint frescoes on the plaster, showing Bible stories and converting the poor people to Christianity. Venice, unlike Assisi, is a place of water with canals and the lagoon flooding the churches, streets and buildings, unsuited therefore for frescoes. So canvas or wood had to be used to paint on. Van Eyck in the Low Countries had experimented mixing oil with pigments and he produced oil paints, transforming the art world forever with their qualities and bright, vibrant colours. Giovanni Bellini was one of the first to buy and use them. As you approach the Madonna and Child triptych, it glows from a distance. Its golden frame designed by Bellini and the Madonna holding the Christ child under a golden apse, four saints stand by. On the left, Saint Nicholas and Saint Peter, and on the right, Saint Mark and Saint Benedict, who is holding a Bible open at Ecclesiastes. He is turned towards you as though he has heard you coming. His eyes halt and arrest you. He's about to speak and ask, who are you? What do you want? Are you fit to come near? But your eyes are drawn in by the use of trompe l'oeil and perspective to look at the central panel. The virgin's blue mantle glows together with more blues and reds and the golden apse shining down on the mother and child. Christ is a beautiful, real baby with hair the colour of Bellini's. His little hand is raised in blessing. Mary, serenely beautiful, gazes into the distance, may be aware of the responsibility she has caring for the Son of God, Jesus Christ, who was born to suffer. Mothers of dead or sick children could pray to this figure for help. Above Mary's head, running round the apse, are the Latin words translated as certain gateway to heaven, Guide my mind, direct my life, may everything I do be entrusted to your care. And I say amen to that. <laughs>